Father, in Jesus' name, I want to thank you for this time of sharing your word. Oh God, meet your people as they reason and watch for the glory and honor of thy name. Meet them at the very point of their needs. Them that are sick, holy of God, I pray that you may send your word and heal them. Them that are discouraged, encourage them in Jesus' name. Amen. My name is Florence Minor, welcoming you to yet another time of celebrating your moment with joy. The title of my message will be, Do Not Be Ignorant of the Devices of the Enemy. Ignorance can be very, very dangerous in our lives. If a driver ignores the road signs and there is a stop sign and you decide to go, that can be detrimental to you and to other people. So you cannot afford to be ignorant as a driver. You have to be keen and pay attention to the traffic rules. A pregnant mother cannot afford to be ignorant and walk any hour or do any or eat any hour. You have to be careful how you do things. You have to be careful what you eat because you know there is something that you are feeding inside and so you are expectant of that baby and also in our spiritual life we have an anointing that we carry and we cannot afford to work in work in hurry. as husbands and wives in our marriages we cannot afford to be ignorant and think that everything will be okay if we just say there we have to work out in our marriages towards good communication so that we can live in harmony Otherwise, the enemy is working 24-7, looking for someone to defile. As a student, you cannot afford to be ignorant when you are given assignment and then there is a time frame for you to forward to your assignment. If you don't do it within the time frame given, you know what, you can fill that test and then you'll be wasting your money and even time. Even if you're given another time to retake, it will be stressful and you're going to be missing another time to do another subject. And you know the word of God is very clear. And that's why I love this word. Second Corinthians 2 verse 11 says, Lest Satan should set, get an advantage of us, for we are not ignorant of his devices. Yes, you cannot be ignorant. Even as an employee, you cannot afford to be ignorant by thinking you can go to work anytime you want, you can call in anytime you want because you are messing up your record. You may not be told, but those records follow you. As employers, you cannot afford to just hire people based on what you, you know, showing prejudice. It's good to show justice. As intercessors, we cannot afford to be ignorant and just stay until when there is a need is when we are going to intercede for our families, for our nation, for our churches. We need to continually intercede so that we can continually live in peace. May the Lord bless you. You are there. You have never trusted the Lord. You cannot assume. You cannot be ignorant and say, I am born in a Christian family. Salvation is personal. You need to tell the Lord, come in and have my life. Take over my life. For a personal relationship. You are there. You have never served. You, you have always given time to serve the Lord. I want to tell you. This is the golden opportunity. Because there is a work for you in the kingdom. Let us pray. Father in Jesus name. Help us not to be ignorant of the devices of the enemy. Help us to be ready at all times. Be equipped like a soldier in the army. In Jesus name. Amen. May the Lord bless you. Let us continue to desire this word. Don't you love this word that it is? A word for each and every situation. God bless.